Hello, I'm Isaac Ostrom. Thanks for checking out another one of my videos. Today I'm going to talk about what to do about cracking grout, which is a real common problem with tile. Grout is a cement product and it has very little flexibility to it. So anytime you get a transition between like a countertop and a wall or a floor and a wall, oftentimes you'll get cracking if you use grout. So uh, there is a solution for that. And what it is, is there's caulking that is made to match grout colors. So if, if you know what grout color you have, it's pretty easy. You could probably do an online search for uh, caulking for the specific brand and grout that you use. The other thing you could do is go get a, a sample chart. This year we like to use um, the Tech Grout, the Power Grout. Uh, we've been really happy with it. It doesn't require a sealer. Um, so I've actually matched up the grout with the right color. And so when I go to my tile shop, I just order up a, a tube of the sanded caulking. So it comes in sanded and unsanded. The sanded uh, obviously has sand in it, so it'll match a sanded grout. Non-sanded is to match a smooth grout, non-sanded grout. So uh, first thing we're going to do is make sure our grout, our, uh, grout joint is uh, nice and clean. We're going to cut away any of the loose stuff uh, with our razor knife. So, so. So now, now that we have our grout joint nice and clean, all of the loose grout, crack grout taken out, we can now fill it with our sanded caulking. So I like to cut 45 degree angle, maybe quarter inch off the tip, 3 16 And so once I have that, I'm just going to lay a nice little bead. Make sure you go slow and get all of the caulking filled in there. If you go too fast, sometimes it'll make little air gaps in there. So make sure you're completely filling everything you can. The more caulking you have in there, the longer it's going to last and hold up. Put our lid back on there and save it. Uh, it. It's a good idea to leave this if this is. It's a good idea to leave this caulking at the job site, whether that's at your house or customer's house. Go ahead and leave them this tube, so either they can touch it up themselves if it happens again, or you can come back and you'll already have a tube. So put the lid on, and sometimes uh, masking tape or duct tape over this to keep it airtight will help keep this caulking fresh. So I just use water. I just use water and a sponge to clean it up. Again, this this isn't silicone caulking. This is an a siliconized acrylic. There's a big difference. Uh, the siliconized acrylic caulking will clean up with just water. It's really nice. It's uh, so for a homeowner, you don't need to be afraid of it because it will clean up with water. So first thing I do is I just take my my damp finger and tool the joint a little bit, get the extra off of there and kind of smash it in there. And then I'm just going to take my sponge and clean up the joint.
So that's all there is to it. It's a piece of cake, uh, something you don't need to be worried about or you probably don't need to hire anybody to do it. And again, if it's a maintenance joint, if you have continual movement going on, it's something that we call a maintenance joint where you know maybe every six months, every year, go back, clean it out, and redo it. So that's it. I hope you got something out of this video. Click like if this helped you out and share it with somebody who, you know, maybe you've seen crack grout at their house and uh, maybe it's a little hint hint if, if, uh, if you're a, a wife, homeowner, you know, maybe shoot this video over to your husband. A little hint for him to uh, finally take care of that cracked grout. So anyways, I really appreciate you guys. I'm having fun making these videos. Uh, so the more you like and subscribe and share this video, the more it motivates me. Leave anything in the comment section, either just a thank you or a question that you have, and I'll do my best to answer it. So thanks again, guys. Rock on. You're doing awesome. Thanks for checking out my videos. See you on the next one.